The Wellness Hour. An in-depth discussion with today's top physicians and medical leaders. And now, your host, Randy Alvarez. You're watching The Wellness Hour, leader in medical news and information. I'm Randy Alvarez. Today's topic, what you need to know about dental implants. With us, we have an expert on the topic, Dr. Mike Golpa. Dr. Golpa, welcome Hi, to the Randy. program. How are you? Now, uh, we have an exciting show today, actually, because we have uh, two of your patients that both, after the dental implant, implant procedure, bit into apples. Right, right. Okay. Well, what do I do? I usually videograph uh, all the patients right after the surgery. I have them bite on an apple so, you know, they can gain and their confidence. And why do you do that? Just to show that they're yeah, strong? Yeah, just to show that it's strong and they can depend on it. Now, in all areas so. of dentistry, uh, and, and you're known as the, the go-to guy for cosmetic dentistry in, in Las Vegas. There's right. no question about that. But now the shift into dental implants, or maybe it's not a shift. You've always been it's focused on both? It's not a shift. I, will, I always did dental implants and, uh, because it's part of the, you know, if, when you do full mud reconstruction, it's all, always part of a full mud reconstruction. So, you, you know, you have to place some implants in case there's a missing tooth. But, you know, I always give the patients the options, what would be the best options for them. Is it more fun, the, the dental implant patients? Yeah, because, the because they are, uh, the implant patient really, you know, they, they, you would change their lives as far as their, their eating, their, you know, not only they're going to get a beautiful smile, but they get their function back, which they never had. You know, okay. if they have loose teeth, they're not going to eat anything, everything. Now, I've so talked to an oral surgeon about this, and they say, a lot could go wrong, Randy. I mean, you got to be careful who it's, you go it's to. It's very technique sensitive. It's a technique sensitive, so you really have to know where, where you want to go to. It's not a, like conventional implants that you're replacing one or two teeth, okay? Conventional implants, a lot of oral surgeons do. There are general dentists out there that do it. But uh, this technique, which is called all on four. All on four. All on four. What does meaning, that mean? Meaning all the teeth going to be screwed onto four implants. Okay, so like and the, the bottom four The bottom implants. four implants, the top four implants. That's something that's fixed. And it's fixed. And it's, and the breakthrough, it's, there's no sinus lift, there's no bone grafting, and they will, patients uh, gets the benefit to enjoy the fixed bridge right after the surgery. And they the can next, bite into an The apple. next day, they can bite into anything they want. You have to be afraid, though, when you tell a patient, okay, you have these new brand Actually, new they're more afraid than I am. So really? I, know, I know that thing's going to be really fixed, and I know they can bite on anything they want. Okay, now you, so, you become the go-to guy in Las Vegas for dental implants. But what, is the, what are the fears out there? Maybe that you could the lay to rest about dental implants. The fear is basically, the first fear is, is, you know, if there's pain involved. There's hardly any pain because it's less invasive. If you have the CT scan, if you have a surgical guide which has already been made, there's no, in, no incision, so there's no suture. We do this study and it's so easy that we can go ahead and place the implants on, onto our software to see exactly what size implants and everything is, is predictable. We know exactly where those implants are supposed to go, what's the density of the bone. These aren't everything. mini implants, are they? Or are no, these are not mini implants. Do you like mini implants? No, I'm, I'm not, uh, I don't believe in mini implants. I look at them as a temporary implant. You don't like them? No. A gimmicky, okay. maybe? Probably, I don't use them, but if any so surgeon use it, uh, you know, yeah, it would be for, if mini implants would be used for maybe t something temporary. Who's the typical patient, by the way? What are the age ranges? Patients, uh, the best candidate for all on four procedures are the patients who are about to lose their teeth or patients who have dentures for a period of five to 10 years. The longer they have the denture, the lesser they become the candidate for this procedure. Okay, you say if they're so, healthy enough to walk into your office. I would be able to. You could probably get I them would fitted. probably be able to, 95% I would be able to give them a fixed bridge on, in one day. So men and women? It it's doesn't about make half a and difference. half. Who comes in more? More women? Fifty-fifty, fifty-fifty. Whoever who is suffering from loose teeth and uh, they have periodontal disease or they have denture which is not fitting right and they don't want to have something removable, they want to have something fixed. Those are my patients. Okay. In prepping so, for this interview, you said you want to make sure we we talked about this. That there are patients that have been turned down elsewhere. That have been told you're not a candidate exactly. for dental implants. Many dentists, they don't have the experience and the technology to uh, perform this procedure. So they're telling so patients, they're telling that, they're patients not, that they're not the really? candidate okay. because they are thinking the conventional way of placing an implants and waiting six months to nine months for bone integration to take place. And not only it's costly for the patients, 
the healing time is much longer, and there's much more involved. So in a perfect situation, three, four appointments, and they get their teeth back. Is in, that right? Basically, in, uh, in a perfect two appointments. Two appointments. First appointment is about two and a half hours. Second appointment, about 10 minutes. So we've known each other, what, six months, I guess? Right. And uh, the week you were coming on the show, I talked to a periodontist right here and uh, from, from Palm Desert, California. She says that it's impossible. You can't do four implants to secure a denture. I hear that all the time. You I do. hear that all the time, but more and more uh, specialists and dentists are becoming familiar with this technology. Good. And uh, you're doing it every it's, day, it's, every it's week. A, I, we do it every day. We do about four to five surgery every week uh, with this typical uh, procedure. People are living and, uh, a long time today. So for people worried That's about true. the they money, they want to benefit. And, you know, they want to go ahead and be able to benefit their life. Okay. the best that it can be, you know. So I love your take on the recession. You say that's a good time to invest in yourself. Right, exactly. It's a sure I investment. Mean, life is too short, you know, okay. so better get the best of it. We're going to take a quick break. We come back. We're going to meet some of your patients. Two patients right. that both, after the surgery, bit into an apple. Bit, this is amazing. Exactly. I haven't seen the tape yet. Yeah. You're watching the Wellness <laughs> Hour, the leader in medical news and information. I'm Randy Alvarez. <laughs> you don't want to miss. In fact, call your friends with dentures. You don't want to miss this next segment. We'll be right back. Are you kidding? <laughs> uh uh. Not gonna happen. Gross. Smile Designs by Golpa offers a unique and long lasting alternative to dentures full dental implants, permanent teeth. Restore your radiant smile, eat what you want, and rediscover the confidence and lifestyle you deserve. All in one appointment. Thank you, Dr. Golpa. No denture. Smile Designs by Golpa. Call us today, 641 7111. You're watching The Wellness Hour, leader in medical news and information. I'm Randy Alvarez. Today's topic, what you need to know about dental implants. With us, we have Dr. Golpa and one of his patients, Frank Vlamings. Uh, Frank, welcome nice to the program. Nice to meet you. Hi, Randy. Yeah, tell me about Frank. Well, uh, Frank uh, was concerned about his remaining teeth on the upper, and he had a, a removable appliance on one side. And so his upper teeth had to go? His upper teeth had okay. to come out, and he didn't want to go to a denture. So what about his lower? His lower, he had an over-denture implant, which he would take in and out. Okay. But his main concern was the upper because he didn't want to have a, a full denture on top. So, so Frank, I mean, how did you hear about Dr. Gopa? I actually found him uh, on the Internet. On I the did internet. a lot of research there. I checked with other uh, dentist there, especially surgeons, and I called him up and asked him what that technology was, the technique that they were using. I had these lower implants placed in there. Okay. Uh, at that time, there was a clean slate. There were no teeth at all in the lower in the lower part of the mouth, and therefore, when they did that, it took six months, six months from Je from the September two o two to March o three before they finally had it all in there. Then another problem I had, and that's why I did not want to go back to that same technology again, that the bridge what were placed over or across the implants, it broke four times. Your lower, the broke lower four ones, times. the lower okay. ones. So then I said, I have to get new implants on the upper part of my mouth, and I want to find out which doctor actually does it differently than that was done before. Do they feel like you're like your own teeth? They feel exactly now, the new one, feel like they're part of me. They're not a part of a story or something. I know what it is like to be without teeth. I know what it is like to be when, when, the, when the standard denture falls out of your mouth. mouth it's so embarrassing. I mean, uh, that is good if you're at home, but if you're in a restaurant, there's nothing as embarrassing. You have to cover your mouth, you yeah. know, too. So your upper is fixed or is the yeah. lower fixed? The upper one so is fixed. So the upper never comes out. The upper one never comes out. Does it we feel like, I mean, they feel like your own teeth? Absolutely. Let me see you smile with those. They look great. So it's cosmetic. Do people compliment <laughs> you on your smile? Oh, they say you're taking 10 years off and ask the doctor if they could take more off, you know, but he said that's very tough. Just 10 years. <laughs> that's all I can do, 10 years. And uh, so you're lower. The lower is something and that the snaps lower, the in, lower we couldn't, snaps yeah, out. It, sna it snaps in, snaps out. Is because, it strong? Because uh, it's yeah, strong, but what about know, a steak? It, a steak? You can eat a steak. Oh, a steak and apple. Anything. Try an apple. We just actually had. Yeah, it, we're going to show a video. I haven't apple, seen yeah, it. Yeah, right after the surgery, yeah. you know. So it's, it's, is it it's painful? Much, <clears throat> is it painful? I tell you that that is what I have to say of this last surgery. It has been an amazing experience to me. I know what I went through for so many months. Okay, before, 
when it breaking, this one breaking off, again there, and I had to go every time through these pain lapses too, this never mentioned anywhere. So when Dr. Uh, so you had Gulpa, implants before. It was very I painful, the took a long one. time. Well, the experience afterwards. Right. Was it bad. was to me it was not done right. Okay? Mm -hmm. I'm not saying that implants are not good. I'm saying that that particular execution of these implants was less than desirable. So this was easy. This, this was a piece of cake. I can't believe it that it was that simple. I mean, you know, when, when Dr. Galpa explained to me what he was going to do, I said, are you sure that I will not have any pain? I said, he said, believe me, and he was right. Is he everybody afraid never, about pain, by the way? Everybody's like afraid, about, everybody's afraid about pain and, you know, the cost. You know, this is a much less invasive How many implants procedure. to give him something fixed uh, in the we upper? We placed four implants. And really? We took an impression and we gave him the teeth the next day. And this yeah. is, and we is had, like we had him, we had him bite on an apple it, right it, away. So. You can't compare that with anything. I mean, if you, had, uh, if you had partials, if you had dentures, you can throw those away. Get implants for heaven's sake. Really? And the one which, I, as Dr. Kalpa says, semi personal, uh, permanent, pardon me, semi permanent. That way, only the Dr. Kalpa can take them out, and if there's any work to be done on it. I don't have to take them out every so time. So you brush I go them to just a, like regular Absolutely. Teeth. Use a water pick, and you'll be surprised how clean they are. Are you and go ahead. I want to tell you one other thing, too. My other friends, they got beautiful teeth, but they can't eat a piece of chocolate. So, oh, no, 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 I gotta get, get cavities. I don't have to worry about cavities <laughs> anymore. <laughs> because of dental implants. Now, uh, is there anything that surprised you? Anything you were able to do or a change in your personality? Lot, or did you smile more? There, there's too much to mention here. The, really? Your own personality, your own feelings, your own confidence and everything else is, is gone sky high all at once. I mean, I feel... But just because of your teeth? Yes, right. Before, I had, I had the rack in there. You know, it was a disaster, actually. And they could fall out any time. I don't know if you ever had, if I was afraid on these pictures, and the pictures will show it here, the picture cannot show how loose the teeth were, okay? And I don't know if you ever had loose teeth, anyone, but if you have that, you're afraid to bite on something because you know you're going to leave it behind. No, okay, so we did a clip, okay? Or, I mean, you did a clip that you right, brought to us. Right after the surgery. So right. they place these dental implants, so I get this correctly. They place the dental implants. Place the dental implants. And then he and bit then into an he apple. He bit an apple right away. Yeah. Because I want, I want him to have confidence with these teeth so he can bite on Were you afraid to do that? I, well, I tell you, it was strange that I had to open my mouth so big for a whole pe big piece of apple. He gave me <laughs> a huge apple, you know. But and isn't said, the implant too loose at that? No I mean, way. No, no, because oh. we, with these implants, the, the beauty of it is, is, you know, we can gain enough stability to place the bridge right away. If so a doctor I'd tells see. me that it takes six months yeah. to for the bone to grab onto that implant before you could bite into an apple. I knew we were going to talk about this today, so right. I asked around. Right. Are you just saying that's old? That is old. That is the old conventional implant. But they used implants. to think this, you're Well, saying. there is a still conventional implants that we have to place for a single tooth, and we have to wait for bone integration to take place. But bone these, integration? Yes. Okay. But then with these implants, we can, we can put them in at, at a very high torque, so we can go ahead and place the bridge right away. And there's, and yeah. there's really and there no pain. You don't no pain. Feel it. It's computer-guided surgery, so it's, it's less invasive. The implant goes right into the bone. There is hardly any preparation. The implant actually cuts into the bone and grabs onto the bone. So that's what's the difference between this implant and the conventional implant. Now, we have one of your female patients that, that uh, flew in for this interview as well. Right. Uh, is it more men, I mean more women than men, or more and, and more men 50, are coming 50. in? 50, really? Whoever who needs, uh, you know, who needs Do you to tell your friends about this, deep. Frank? A lot. They see <laughs> what it do they say? Day. They say, you look good. I said, just look good. I feel good, too. <laughs> That's the important part to me. Are you eating you know? foods that you stayed away Any from before? Any food. I can eat steaks, even. The, even I mean, tough steaks, you know. Even, before I couldn't do that, I was afraid to leave things behind. You know, and that I was biting on my own teeth, basically. You know, not anymore now. Dr. I can eat any, any, I, I eat hard candy, which I won't do right there because I'm always afraid to chip things, you know. Okay. But uh, before, I could never eat an apple. I had to cut it like, like an old man, you know, in little pieces mm -hmm. and all of that. No more. Now, Does it make you feel younger? Oh, so much. I feel, yeah. I don't know how many years younger, but. You do. <laughs> it just feel good. <laughs> yes, is it better than you expected? Oh, there's no comparison to be made because I went through six months waiting time before I finally had the lower ones in it and then to go through all these repeats and repeats. But and not repairs. with Dr. Gopa? No way. This is two months ago. Well, then this what were you done. doing different than the other dentist? 
without being well, negative? Ba basically, uh, there's a lot of dentists out there that they claim that they do this procedure and they even advertise for this procedure. But they dabble in it? But or? then when the patient comes in, they tell them, you know what, you are not the right candidate. We still have to go through the conventional way of placing yeah. implants, waiting six months, doing bone grafts, sinus lift, and everything. So, so you're the surgeon and you do the surgery? I do the surgery and I do the from A to Z. Yeah, normally do that's do done by two different people. Exactly. Is that right? It's done by the oral surgeon or a periodontist and the prosthetic part is done by... And, and Frank, when did you know, when you met Dr. Golpa, when did you know this is the doctor? Did you, immediately, did you have a, immediately because I asked some key questions. I asked the questions, will I truly not feel that pain as I have in the past? And Dr. Golpa immediately verified that said no way because he knew what I went through, you know, as a professional. And I had to go through it as a client, as a customer. Well, my well, mother is, is one of those people. I sent her to you. Right. They said, not enough bone. Right, you said. exactly. So is there so always what, enough bone, by the way? Well, we use whatever bone is existing. I'm not saying yeah. that everybody is a candidate. Okay. But the, most, uh, the best candidates are the ones who are losing their teeth, who are about to lose th their teeth, or who had denture for maybe five to ten years. Okay. So the longer they had the denture, the lesser they become the candidate. So. Frank, there are other people that will, and we're going to have to take a quick break. There are other people that are going to watch this program. They have dentures, but they're afraid of the pain, the process. What do you say to them, the people that are afraid? I would say this here. Their biggest fear is being always what I have found out is cost. They always talk about, oh, yeah, but they're so-and-so. I said, I asked them, I said, look, I've been through the same exercise as you've been, okay? You, you survive and you say, oh, my dentures are fitting good and all of that, and how many times do you have to replace them because they lo no longer fit properly? I said, and we forget about that. In the meantime, you go through a lot of embarrassment that these things falling out. You have to put the glues in it. I call it glues, you know, to have them stay in place. Did you and hate that glue? I hate that glue because I had a problem to get it out, you know, clean really? it out. Now is a water pick. Now I don't have to worry anymore. I can even eat some candy and not worry about it, you know. All right, now we're going to take a look at the video. You're in the video, Dr. Gopal. What are we going to look at here? Well, we're going to look at, uh, we, we placed a bridge, we secured the bridge onto the implant, and we had Frank bite on an apple right away. Right after the yeah. surgery. Right after, right after, the day he after the surgery. He has his teeth the right. day after the yeah. surgery, the after and he the bites surgery. into an apple. Okay, right. we'll take a look. We do this in one appointment and sometimes in two appointments. Uh, we do the surgery in one day and the next day the patient comes in and gets the teeth. That way they don't have to wait here. Come really quick, oh, come back, oh, come back. You might uh, feel a little bit of uh, impingement on the tissue. Mm -hmm. Denture over implant. Yeah. Uh, we do have the option to go with a fixed bridge, but I still want you to buy an apple to okay. show our audience okay. how secure this bridge is. Mm. Great. And that directly after <laughs> surgery. <laughs> you can know it. That's one day after the oh, surgery. Yeah. So. Give me a thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Frank, excellent. Wow. Good thank for, you. Good for you. Good for, and thank you for coming on the show. Very articulate. And uh, Dr. Gopa, we're going to meet your uh, next patient. Nice patient. And right. uh, we'll be right back. You're watching right. the Wellness Hour, the <laughs> leader in medical news and information. I'm Randy Alvarez. If you are thinking about dental implants, you cannot miss this next segment. We'll be right back. There's a new secret to looking younger, an advancement so profound it took a team of scientists years to create a time machine called Zoom. Getting Zoomed is the fastest way to erase years from your looks. Zoom is the most advanced teeth whitening ever. Only your dentist has it. Nothing works like it. Zoom gel gently penetrates the submicron pores of tooth enamel. The patented Zoom light super activates the gel through a unique photofenton reaction. 
breaking down the stain's double bonds. In just 45 minutes, years of discoloration disappear, transforming your smile to wow. To find a Zoom dentist near you, go to ZoomNow.com or call 800-891-4895. For your whitest, most confident, most irresistible smile, get Zoomed today. Make your appointment at ZoomNow.com or call 800-891-4895 today and discover the wow of Zoom. You are watching The Wellness Hour, leader in medical news and information. I'm Randy Alvarez. Today's topic, what you need to know about dental implants. We are here with another patient of Dr. Golpa's. Uh, we are here with Jean Sanchez. Jean, welcome to the program. Thank, Thank you. you so much. But Dr. Golpa, you said you know at the break that Jean is a like a typical patient. Tell me. Right. Well, Jean uh, came to me from actually a long distance. Uh, She'd been through many consults with different uh, dentists and oral surgeon, and uh, she knew that she had to get either denture or an implant. She so didn't you, were want to go that, you were at that position right. Right. where they said your teeth right. have to all be removed. Right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And right. Then? So when she came to me, she says, you know, there's no way she wants to go to a denture, not even over denture, which is basically snap in and snap out. She wanted her so teeth back. So she wanted her teeth back. So uh, because of the periodontal disease, um, you know, she had to have all the teeth on top. Wow, what am I looking at there? It. Well, basically what you're looking at, you're looking at a broken bridge, which is all, uh, you have gum recession. So the left side of her mouth. Yeah, the left side is actually the right side is actually all decayed down. The bridge mm -hmm. was completely loose and all the teeth had uh, now, extreme the, mobility. So the dark above her teeth. The dark the... above the teeth is basically the tooth structure, which is all decayed down. Okay. And basically the bridge and every tooth, uh, single tooth on top, had to come out because of uh, periodontal disease. So how did you hear about Dr. Golpa? Well, we went to a health fair in Las Vegas, yeah. and uh, I saw this picture. We were given a package and of health magazines and all this. So I saw Dr. Golpa's, and they had dentures on post. So I told my honey, and he said, well, let's call him up and see what he has to say. No more dentures. I yes. think that's what he put No more dentures, and they were on post. So were you going to get dentures until you saw that ad with Dr. Gopa? Reluctantly, yes. Oh, really? Interesting. Yeah. So you drove, now by the way, I, I spoke to your husband. He goes, you know, I think it's important to mention that we drive 235 miles to see Dr. Gopa. That's correct. So you drive That's over correct. to Dr. Gopa, what happens? Okay, we get there, we have a consultation with Dr. Gopa. He tells us what it entails, what it'd have to do, how it would look. So uh, my honey and I, we go home and we talk and we say, let's do it. Okay. <laughs> so what was it? What would you, well, you have to do for her? Well, all basically, of her teeth had to go. all the teeth had to go, and she was uh, stunned as far as she was surprised that you know everything is going to be done in one appointment, and she will get a fixed bridge in one appointment. So she fixed set of teeth. Fixed set of teeth in one appointment. On the right lower. Right after the surgery, on the upper. She, her on her the main upper? concern was the upper one. What about the lower? Well, the lower teeth. Uh, she has all her lower teeth, and own teeth. they're doing fine. So. Now we have a video of you. Okay, so I guess yeah. First time you have your teeth in, the upper, and they're fixed, and he asks you to film it while you're biting into an apple. You had to right. be afraid of that. Right. Were you scared? Well, not really, because they felt tight, you know, a little bit. So I said, okay, he wants me to buy an apple. Okay, I trust him, I buy an apple. <laughs> so Was it a little the, painful, by the way? When I bit the apple? Yeah. No. Not painful. I went to dinner after we left Dr. Copa's office. <laughs> what did you eat? What did you eat? <laughs> we went to Circus Circus yeah. Buffet. We okay. had a little bit of <laughs> All right. A little bit of energy. How this was the day after the surgery. I mean, there was yeah. hardly, you know, any pain. And how how has it changed your life? Dr. Copa would say, I have patients that have changed their lives. This yeah, well, more, it's, it's more confident for me now because I, I work with people and I can smile without my teeth looking fake because most people don't even know their their dentures so and when they give me a compliment I just say thank you and keep going but if I have friends that you know say oh wow and it didn't hurt I said no it didn't hurt that's the surprising part right, about it so them. Dr. Gopa so I understand this correctly because it's bone that's why there's really no pain because well, there's, there's no, no nerve in the bone, you okay. know, and the, the procedure is done very, uh, there's not a lot less of cutting. invasive, there's not much cutting. If there's CT scan and if the surgical guide was planned in advance, there's, there's no incision, so there's no suture. Okay. But yeah. in Jean's case, we actually didn't have the surgical guide, so, you know, we placed the implant. So did you have pain at all that no. night when you were eating? No. 
So at Circus Circus, did your husband say, hey, you better be careful with these things? Heck no, we took pictures and everything. Because after, <laughs> <laughs> is this common though that people are this happy after they get dental They're all happy. I could have had like about 40 patients here today, but then. <laughs> really? After we had eaten so much, we all go, and he took the picture. So, so tell no. us about Dr. Gopa, and, and we're going to go to your clip right now. Okay. What was it like going to him? Dr. Gopa was different because he was more like a friend. Really? Okay. He wasn't like, okay, okay, I'm a dentist, you're a patient, okay, let's get this out wet and go. <laughs> okay. So it was more friendly atmosphere, you know, rather than Because a he's doctor. very reserved on my show. <laughs> <laughs> Have you noticed that? But off, when the cameras turn off, he's friendly and smiles. Yeah. So Dr. Gopa, set up this clip uh, of her. What, what, what are well, we looking at? Well, uh, basically, you know, uh, just like uh, Frank, we went ahead and gave her an apple right after the surgery. And, have and why do you do that? Apple. Just to prove how strong just the teeth are? Just to prove how strong it is, you know, just so the patient will gain confidence, you know, with their teeth. So. Were there any tears, by the way? Because you have a beautiful smile. Tears? When you saw your smile for the first time, is it an emotional experience? It's a happy experience because you know you have something that's permanent and they're not, they won't embarrass you and people don't know that they're really dentures, but they're curious and say, because uh, I told one friend and I said, well, you know, they're um, fixed. Yeah, they're, they're fixed. Because they're not yeah. really dentures. And yeah. she says, what? <laughs> and I said, yeah. So right. she said, and then they ask more questions and about, you know, how it was done and all of that. So. Well, good. Thanks for coming on the show. We're going to go to the clip and then we're going to take a break. Sure. Great. Yes. Now, these are the teeth. We'll just put them on. And it should fit right in. Wow. And slightly bigger. Should be screw on. Huh? There should be a screw. Oh, yeah, which one? Good. Oh, yeah, you can take it, take it back with it, so. All right, are you ready to bite on an apple? All right. So just bite the apple. Just bite the apple. Hold on, you ready? Yeah, mm -hmm. go ahead. Okay. Yeah, one more. <laughs> Wait. You've been watching The Wellness Hour, leader in medical news and information. I'm Randy Alvarez. If you would like to see this interview again, visit our website at wellnesshour.com. Just put in keyword Dr. Golpa, and uh, you can even direct a friend to it. So for now, I wish you good health. Thanks for watching The Wellness Hour, the leader in medical news with your host, Randy Alvarez, the authority on health issues.